guys. Make a face out of my video. <laughs> oh guys, this is me Rachel and in this video I'm just going to be showing you how I made this poster wall for my room. I made it some time ago actually. It's been a couple of weeks. <laughs> I suck at editing, but essentially, yeah, this video is just how I made it and I hope it's as fun to watch as it was to make because it was really fun. It was very tiring, but it was really fun and I love it so much. Alright, so step one will be to draw the plan, right? So this is me just drawing the plan. I'm referring to a picture from uh, Pinterest on the left and yeah. We are going to go measure the wall! Okay, so first off, we have the mounting board. So now that we have our materials, we can actually get into measuring it. I did not have enough mounting board, so I ended up using cardboard after this. So you'll see me using cardboard after this. But essentially what I did was I measured out the board, I divided it into pieces. Then I marked where I knew I would need to cut based on the draft from earlier. And then I just cut it along those lines. So. It's pretty intuitive, if you ask me. The focus is gonna be terrible. I'm so sorry. This is... The exact same as the mounting board, I'm just marking the lines and then cutting along those lines. That's it, that's all I'm doing. Okay, that's done. Next step, we are going to try to arrange everything and see if it fits. And so now, that we have all the pieces of boards, everything ready, we can begin to kind of like design things, you know? Okay, I'm filming. You're gonna be in the frame, I think. Don't drip water on the cardboard. Do not drip water on my cardboard. If you drip water on the cardboard, you will be in big trouble. What's this? What? Shh. If I drip water. I'm assembling this thing, Chloe. Okay, see? I'm going to be cutting around this braid and I'm going to be pasting it on. Is that twist? This one. It kind of looks familiar. It's a twist. Hey guys! Make a face out of my video. Oh. <laughs> hey, go back to your room, Chu. Okay, now we get to the interesting part, which is, um, you know, just putting everything together. So this is not yet installing it on the wall. This is just me kind of like piecing everything together, making all the parts, hand lettering all the pieces, and just, you know, gluing all the pictures and stuff. So, yeah, this is the assembly. This is where you get to see all the elements just come together and form such a cohesive piece and it's just so nice, I swear. This is what I've got so far and I'm pretty happy with how it looks. I think you can tell that's the moon in Saturn. It kind of looks like an astronaut with like a ring around its head but
And now it's the very last bit, which is just my sign. This is my trusty table. So before I put it up on the wall, I just added some finishing touches and that's what you're seeing me do right now. Okay, so I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to be doing this, but anyways, I got some glue tag, or tag it, we call it glue tag. I don't think that's its actual name, but anyway, and I'm just going to be sticking some of this stuff onto the corners of the boards that I have and then we are just going to be trying to position them on there. I'm not sure if I should be drawing guidelines or something. I have absolutely zero clue <laughs> how I'm supposed to get this there. But you know, we're just gonna try things out and see what happens. Like, I mean, what's the worst thing that can happen, right? <laughs> We're gonna start off with this board. This is like almost the last step. This is just me assembling everything, putting everything up on the wall, and just... I actually thought I would have to move things around, but I did not, so that was cool. This is just me placing everything on the wall, and I'm just so happy! This makes me so happy! <laughs> Can you see it? Okay, so you cannot really see it. So that is the poster wall. I like it. So this is the last step. I just went in and just strengthened it. I added more tacket to the corners, made sure it was really sticking. Let me give you a better look at it. That's the start and that's the bottom. I am so proud of this. So 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 proud of this. It kind of looks like an astronaut, but I think that's also cool, so I accept it. I love these. These. Below! <laughs> this is the great coincidence. This is the moon, I think. The moon, Jupiter, and Saturn. My favorite Taylor Swift album, Evermore. That's a cool empty crust, not broken, which is very true. That's a rare picture of Taylor that I found on Tumblr. This is a quote that I wrote on my own. Okay. I just want to say this message is to me really important. Today I will be kind to myself. You know, we should always try to be kind to ourselves. And then I just put <laughs> I just put pictures of me. Because it's my wall. What else would I be putting? Only the young, my favorite song. <laughs> Until folklore and evermore happen, but And of course we are doing a Taylor Swift team, so Taylor always says love Taylor, so I did love Rachel, that's my sign. This is another quote I wrote that I'm very proud of. And so this, my friends, is the wall. I'm trying not to fall off my bed. This is the wall. And that is the end of the video, I'm sorry it's so shaky. Goodbye! That's all I have for now, goodbye. And that is all. Thank you for watching.